Last episode, y'all saw me have one of the best games in college history. But that game is in the past, because next up is the playoffs. So I'm about to head to the track, get a few sprints in, get a workout in before the game. So I try to start all of my workouts with some meditation. It's good for the soul and the brain, and it helps me with concentration, so I'm in my right mind for the games. Then I do some normal stretching, get the bones loose. Tell you I'm going to just do a one lap around the track, maybe a 40, just to get my legs pumped. Before we get to the 90, we got Florida State first. They got some dogs over there, but on the other end, it's LSU versus Ohio State. And I already know Marvin Harrison Jr. is not about to let it end all right there. So if we get past them, I'm already knowing we're just going to be Marvin Harrison Jr. in Ohio State. It's going to be even more tough to be Ohio State, but we got to stay locked in on this game first. But hey, if y'all been enjoying this series, leave a like, comment, subscribe, because this series is almost over. But we ain't done yet because I'm working on the next series right now. So y'all stay tuned. Now, with that being said, let's get to our first playoff game. We are here with playoff football. The atmosphere is through the roof. It's the conference championship. Should be like the Sugar Bowl or the Rose Bowl, but I couldn't change the stadium. But we got to do what we got to do with these mods. But, yeah, now we finna get on with this game, and let's get cracking. Y'all see, I'm leading the team out because they're wondering, is this going to be my last game, or am I going to commit again next year, or what's going to happen? But we finna see. So they got the ball first, and they came down and only got a field goal, which is good for our defense, that we only let up a field goal. But we coming out first and 10, and we throw a nice five-yard game, and now we finna get the ball rolling. We lined up at second and five. Who y'all know they going to? The go-to man, me. Nice catch right here, and I fell. I wasn't trying to take no hit that fast. So like I told y'all before, we rolling. So now we up at first and ten. Look what Shador going to do. He's going to split right through and get a nice game. I try to help him with the block, but I get right in his way and stop his momentum. But he got, some, he got a nice little 18-yard run off of that. Now at first and ten... I'm in a huddle like, look for me because I want this to be my game. So we come to me again. Look what I'm doing. I'm going to make sure I get that first down. I don't care what I get after that, but I'm making sure I get at least the first down. Look at me. I'm hyped. I'm turned for this game. So now we're getting closer to the end zone. We line up at first and 10. I do a cut, but look, I set my man Passarello wide open for the first touchdown in the playoff game. And my boy turned. You know I had to go celebrate with my boy. But what What do you know about this? What do you know about this dance right here? But, you know, we had to get it cracking. And now we're going to send it to our defense, see if they can do. So our defense came through in the clutch again. But look at this cheese right here. Shador throws a nice interception. And that's setting them up for some nice field advantage. They could potentially score right there as well. So they actually scored, which I kind of figured they would. So we lined up at first and 10. Pass right gets the ball. And look at me right here. I need to go to some, take some block class lessons or something because I'm steady whiffing blocks, but at least he got that first down. But I tried to psych him out right here, but look at the defender come back with a nice swat. So now we're going to line up at second to 10 and hand it out to my boy Dylan Edwards. Look at the block. But, you know, I had to stop blocking because I got a bad rep or always getting called for the penalty, so I had to lay low. But he got that nice little 24-yard run. So then we come out at first and 10 trying to get another big game. But look at the defense right there for the nice breakup. And now it's second and 10. They ain't trying to go. And they up by three. So we come out with a nice run. And look at that boy Dylan Edwards. He fighting through them and trying to get a nice first down. Hey, he said this is his game. He doing everything this game. But now with this first and 10, look at the defense. Watch the defense just break through everybody and get Shador for the sack. And none of the receivers could get open as well. They was not playing that. Now, second and 15, obviously, we're looking for a big pass play, and that's exactly what he got. Look at me right there. And I tried to juke right here, but the def I juke one of them, but the defender was right there to push me right down. Hey, but look, now we in the red zone. Now, I told y'all I was hungry this game. It's my first playoff game ever, and look at this. My first playoff touchdown, and you know I got to spike the ball on this one because I'm hyped. And I know Travis Hunter and them boys came in the clutch on defense, but now look at their defense. They said, if we can't score, y'all not scoring. They get the nice sack. Now we are second and 16. So since we got a sack on the play before, we're looking to run up this time just to get close back up to the line. That's exactly what he did. My boy Dylan Edwards got us to third and 10. Now that that's third and 10, we're going to go for the first down. And look at this. Look at this. What I just tell y'all? A flag. On who? 
who y'all guess is on? It's on me. A legal block in the back. I don't know what's going on. I just can't help myself. So now we're looking to get another first down on here. And look, we go short and we get a nice five yard gain. So then we up at second and five. We hand the ball off to Dylan Edwards so he can try to get a first down. He's breaking tackles, but Austin gets tripped up. And now it's third and four. Now we got to see if we can get this first down because we don't want to punt the ball. So at third and four, we should have hit the cut through the middle, which is why I up him, but he chose a different decision. And now it's fourth and four. And now we're punting the ball and see what our defense can do. So they score. Now we're trying to see if we can put some more points on the board before the half. And we do a nice little pass right here and sets up the first down. And guess who it is? My boy Jimmy Horn Jr. He turned. Look at him. So now we're looking for big gains. And look, I'm wide open. I'm calling for it, but I guess he had another decision. And it looks like he ran the ball and didn't get that much. Well, I don't know. I've been MIA most of the whole second quarter. But now this is my first catch this whole quarter, I believe. And I dropped the ball. I dropped the church's money. Now it's third and four. And now we lined up third and four. But watch this run right here from Dylan Edwards. He running like he got some money on the line. That boy is getting through all these tackles. We get the nice first down with a minute left in this first half. So now we're up in the first and 10, trying to get a big game, but we ultimately go short again. But the defense is right there for the stop once again. Now it's second and 10. Now we're running out of time, trying to see if we can put some points on the board before the half. And from the looks of it, we are not getting that point on the board because we get broken up again on the pass. Now it's third and 10. But now I'm like, I got to make some shake. So I call for the ball ASAP. I want to at least get the first down. I tried to break a couple tackles, but I didn't. But now we got the first down. Now we're going to hurry up offense. We try to go with a little nice post route, but that didn't work because the defense was right there to stop that play. And now we got to think of something new. So lined up first and goal. We're looking for a nice quick pass via Passarella. He breaks the tackle, but look at the defense right there to clean it right up. So now with time going down, 24 seconds left, we try to go for a quick pass in the end zone, and that's stopped from the defense. So now with the with our last chance to score, they tell me in huddle that they looking for me to make a big play, so I got to make a big play. I break free, but look at the defender. Stay right there. See the ball coming. Swats it down, and now we're just going to tie the ball up and send it to the half. Now we lined up at first and one, and Shador's going to do a nice flare pass to the running back, and we're going to get a nice little game, but look at me right there. For the push in the back, now we're going to bring it back. When it was first and 17, we lined up. I'm going to try to get the nice first down, but look the defense right there to break up the pass. Now it's second and 17. We're going to try to put some more points on the board. We got to get some big gains, though, but these passes we throwing is not cutting. Now we're third and 17. We're trying not to go for the three and out. Let's see what we can do. But like I said, we're not trying to get here with the three and out, so I tell Shador to fling that boy to me. Look at the nice catch. We can't go out like that. We need this game. This game is... Go big or go home, win or go home. So, you know, I had to come out there and make a big play. And then one play goes into another play. I pick up another big game right there. Now we marching down the field trying to put some points on the board. Trying to come out here and see if I can get another touchdown on the board for the team. I break off with a slant, and I'm trying to pick up the first down, but the defense is right there. But we get a nice eight-yard gain off that pass right there. So now we're going to hand the ball off to my boy Dylan Edwards, and he should have broke left. He could have got a big game because I had to block, but we settled for something, and we still get the first down on that play. So on this play, we line up, and we go for a nice quick pass that unfortunately did not go well. He threw the ball way behind me, and I still double tried to make the play, but the defense was right there for the stop, and I was second to 10. In the huddle, I'm like, look for me as I break through on the back shoulder, catch it for a touchdown. So we got the score on our end, but look what happened on their end, too. Our defense was not there, and they ended up getting their score right there. And now their defense is playing even harder because we can't even get nothing right now either. And you see what I mean by this play right here, too? Because look at the run. get stuffed right up the middle. Now we third and 11. But all of our third down conversions has been coming through in the clutch with this nice pass right here from Shador to Passarella for the nice first down. Now we moving the chains again. So now we finna move up the chains again with this run from Dylan Edwards. He doing too much in the backfield when he could have just went straight and got some more yards. We'll take the six-yard run. And I don't know what this play was right here. We both did a slant. It just didn't work out, but now it's third and four. Now we're trying to avoid the three and out, but look what happens. 
he catch the ball and he drops it. Now we got to punt the ball and hope our defense can come in the clutch like they've been coming to. So now we go for a trick play on this play right here. We're going for a read option and a shovel option pass, but that goes nowhere because the defense is all on that one as well. So now we line up with second down to run. He jumps over his teammate. Honestly, I don't know how he didn't get leveled off that because coming off that little hurdle, if somebody else would have been there and rocked his world, and that ball would have fumbled. But that's not even the worst part. Look at this cheese right here. They get the interception for a pick six. Now, if y'all know about that, that's actually deja vu. Because remember, we lost a game in overtime just like that in the season. So defense really been locking me up this game. I ain't even going to lie to y'all. But I'm getting double covered every time. And look right there again. I try to call for the long ball. And the defense right there, they not letting up. And then they got the lead, too, at that. When I was one second left to the fourth quarter we're gonna try to see what we can do we ain't really trying to do much just get a nice big game going into the fourth and that's exactly what we do so now it's the start of the fourth and i'm gonna do my famous quick slam but i'm gonna take the fall right there because it was not looking good if i would have caught that ball from any direction so now since i've been getting locked up all game and we still losing some gotta shake so my boy here my boy jimmy horn jr right there for the nice catch and now we rolling so now we in a huddle. We like, bro, we got to get some points on the board. It's the fourth quarter. We can't go home after this. So we get the nice catch again. And now we moving the chains once again. And then we go hurry up offense right here to see if we can catch them off guard. And look at that. Look at that nice pass. Nice catch for the one-yard line. I was almost at the touchdown. We thought we got it. But now we got the first down. We're going to put the points on the board right now. So at first and goal, we're going to try to let our running back get some love. And the defense is right there. They blow right through the line and get the stop. Now we're behind the line. So now we're trying to put points on the board, but the defense is not going. So I motion right, and I come with the cross break and try to break back through. But they throw it short, and the defense stops us once again, and now it's third down. So they took me out for third down to try to get a run play, and that didn't work. So now we're going for it on fourth down because there's six minutes left in the fourth. And we try to do a nice slant, and he throws it behind me. Which now is turnover on downs. And now we got to pray that our defense comes through again. Defense came through. And now it's our turn to try to score and try to at least tie the game up. So we get a nice little short game right there. The defense has been stopping me from getting any touchdown. I've been getting light, nice little small yards. But when it comes to touchdown, they have not been letting up. So now that it's second and ten, we're looking for to try to at least get the first down. We get a nice opportunity right here. But he's overthrown. And now it's third and 10, and now we're starting to get shaky because there's only three minutes left. So now I got to turn into God mode. So they're going to throw me the ball right here. I'm going to pick up the nice game. So if this is it right here right now, I'm going to talk with the coach to see what I should do. Should I stay or should I go? But look at these nice two key blocks I got right there for the nice big game for my boy Dylan Edwards. No, we are not giving up with three minutes left in the game. We are trying to either tie the game and potentially send it to overtime or try to get the victory right here. But I already know this is going to end up in the scouting report because look what happened once again. I get hit for the illegal block in the back, and now we're bringing the ball back again. So now it's first and 18. Now I'm thinking since I'm the one that caused the penalty, I should be the one that bring us back. So I'm going to try to get open right here and see if we can at least get the first down. I break through, but look at the defense is right there as always. Breaking up the pass, and now it's second and 18. And it's not starting to look good for us either. But the defense already know that they're going to be looking for me because I am the star receiver. So they look for me again, and look, I dropped the church's money. Now it's third and 18, and it's still starting to look very scary for us. It might look like it looked like we might be going home. So now it's third and 18. I'm locked up again. So they go a different way, and he locked up as well. And now it's fourth and 18, and we don't know what we're going to do now. So now the defense came in the clutch. We kicked the field goal. So now it's closer, but we still got to put some points on the board if we want to win the game. And it's under two minutes left. So now let's see what we can do if we can get that W. Well, now the game plan here is to see if we can get as close as possible so we can get a touchdown. We got to do that in under a minute and 30 seconds. So everybody else is getting good plays except for me. So it looked like they defense just don't care. They say as long as he don't get the ball, we don't care what we're doing. So with that being said, we're going to let somebody else do some work. So we pick up the nice first down right here. And you see what I was saying? They don't care who getting the ball as long as it's not me. So then we do a hurry up offense and see if we can pull off right here. And Shador gets leveled in the backfield. And now, but at least he didn't drop the ball. And I was second and ten.
But I don't want to be labeled as a guy that can't perform in the playoffs So I'm going to catch the ball here and pick up a nice little game Tried to get out of bounds so I could stop the clock But that did not work But like I said, I'm putting this team on my back Nice catch right there again Almost get the touchdown But now look, it's 54 seconds left And we right on the one yard line So now it's the one yard line Go big or go home 54 seconds left And I catch the ball for the touchdown a game winning touchdown We going to the next round We going to the natty Next game is the championship I'm praying that it's not Ohio State But I already know it's going to be Ohio State And that's the game right there Game winning touchdown Let's send them boys home And we will be paying close attention to whoever wins Out the LSU versus Ohio State game So we can be ready for the natty And I'll see y'all in the next video